have a more serious question to ask you. Do you think BTS should be exempt from the military? You know it's compulsory to go to the military for two years. Do you think they should be should go in or not? Yeah, I do. They should go in? Absolutely not. No, why do you think they should? They should <laughs> learn how to be men. <laughs> That's fair enough. That's a fair enough. It's compulsory. I mean, they only contribute like $3.2 billion to the Korean economy. Yeah, yeah. And they have represented Korea. They have made like their world wide. They've carved a path, though, I think, more. I don't know. They've paved the way. I think that's what we say. The way. The way. Uh, do you think they should be exempt? Um, say yes. No. No, no, no. They're already doing a lot for Korea and everyone around the world. They're all, like international, so they're already doing loads, so they don't really need to go to war, do they? Fair dues, actually. That's a fair enough point. Well, there is the big issue for army as well. <laughs> yeah, but me, oh, well, actually, I'm from Korea. So, yeah, as Korea, it's just like mandatory for men to have uh, military service. And then if they are the one who decide, and then, well, we're going to just, yeah. We support, we support, we support yeah. their decision if yeah. they think that they should. Or maybe all the armies from all the world, we can just pray for our nations united. Oh my god, what a lovely message. I love that. No, everyone has to do it, so, so it's yeah. fair, I think. Even though they contribute $3.2 billion to the Korean economy. They do. The thing is, RM speaks English. If, I don't know, they've been really successful, and that has been mainly, I think, RM's kind of contribution. Do you think? I like that viewpoint. Because the thing is, there are loads of K-pop artists who can speak English, yeah. and groups like GOT7, Stray Kids, like they've got people from all around the world, like Australia, Hong Kong, and everyone's kind of international. But BTS has mostly contributed to probably around America yeah, and Western. probably Western people, and then other groups such as like GOT7 and Stray Kids, they might be more famous within Asia. I think it's their decision. If they want to go, they should. I think they would want to go because it's like their duty. So I don't know. It's up to them. If they want to go, they can. If they don't, I won't say anything. You just want them to be happy and whatever they decide, you support. I'll support them. No. no. You think they should go into the military for two years? Yeah. It's part of their culture? Yeah. Yeah, so I think so, yeah. All right, okay. Do you think yeah. they should go into the military? Yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah they should, yeah. Their choice, because yeah. it's part of their own own. their own nation, so yeah. they should do yeah. what they please. As much as it would disappoint me, it's their duty. So, you support it, this is the decision. Yeah, it's, it's, just, it's part of their culture, so if they want to go in, then they should. Oh, they'll miss them very much. Yeah. I know, it's going to be, is this like the last time they're actually going to perform together for a while? Because it's because their their age is what twenty one to twenty six, and they're all going to do two years, and they all have to go in at different times. So is it going to be the last time we see them for a while as a septet? No one really knows. It's nothing's been said really. They don't, I think, want to talk about it. An American interviewer asked them when they were in the states, um, and John Cook just said, "I don't even want to think about that right now because it's just too sad." I don't think it'll happen for a while, but if it does, Army would obviously support them all. Oh 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 no. Mm, no. I, don't know. I don't think they would want that. They. they They've already said that they are yeah. going to like enlist anyway, but it wouldn't send a good image out if they didn't. Do if it. they did, because it's like part of their culture, it's yeah, something that they I should do. Think. I don't think anybody should be forced to do it, okay. but I don't know. It really depends. If they want to, we support that decision. Yeah. Mm -hmm. If they want to. Yeah. Yes, most definitely. So I don't think they should be. Um, I mean, they are citizens of Korea, and at the end of the day, in Korea, it is seen as like a birthright to be able to do that. So I don't think they should be excluded from that at all. To be fair, as much as I love them, I don't think so because they are wonderful and they have done so much, but I feel like putting them on a pedestal in that kind of way would be really unfair. And the amount that they contribute to the uh, Korean economy as well, I think. It wouldn't make any sense. Yeah, it's kind of, it's um, in the middle. It's kind of controversial, yeah. No. No, you think they should go in and do their yeah. two years? Unfortunately, yes, they have to go in because there is nothing special for, um, for like, so uh, according to the law and everything, there's nothing that makes them uh, allowed to be exempt and they can't be given a special status because the line, uh, the line that you, you can't really draw and this, this is a problem in the Korean society and personally, I don't think that makes sense. And we already have a lot of problems and a lot of discussions because of the sports uh, stars and, uh, and their exemption. So this is a very... Uh, quite controversial. Yeah, yeah, for the Koreans especially. So it's not going to be uh, well looked upon.
upon. So if they are, if they do decide to be exempt, then it won't go down very well in Korea with the citizens of Korea. Well, it's going to be a lot of controversy because it has to, uh, it has to come from somewhere in the government, and no one's going to like that, especially the Korean men, because they had to go to the compulsory, and it's not really fair for them just because they're not. You know, I mean, I understand. Well, no, but what about so if they contribute 3.2 billion dollars to the Korean economy? Is that I'm just trying to weigh it up here. If we say that people with money can just not go, that also becomes another problem. So it's really not contributing cult culturally. Well, then you can say that about the sports stars too, and then that's like um, slowly fading away too. So it's like I don't know. For me personally, I don't think it makes sense. I think this might be the last time they're all performing together. Yeah, that's I'm very. Scared. I think so too. I think it might yeah, be the last time together. That. Which I that, like thinking about it, but it could be, really could be. That would be absolutely petrifying. But we have to support the boys, don't we? We've spoken to the BTS army fandom crowd. Uh, I think everyone's just genuinely really, really excited. It's the biggest show. It's 90,000 capacity here, and they're playing two nights, completely sold out. I managed to get tickets. Don't ask me how. Um, but yeah, I can't. Wait and we will see you on the other side. Thank you!